Arsenal versus Manchester United. Before I get, just in case you're watching the clip and not the full length video, if you're not watching the full length video, we do do a full length video uh, previewing all 10 games uh, if you're just watching the clip. Uh, we are moving over to sportsbookreview.com. We um, are the sister site. Ausmarket is the sister site for Sportsbook Review. We used to be on Sportsbook Review. We came over to Ausmarket and we are moving back. We are strengthening Sportsbook Review and uh, basically bringing our European content um, over there. So a video will be found on if you type in SBR uh, Sportsbook Review in the um, search bar in YouTube. Uh, you'll find us. It's the SBR with the bull with the logo on the logo. Um, or follow us on Twitter at SBR Sports Picks. Uh, you get notifications of shows. We do an NBA, NHL. We do everything, to be honest. Bowls. You'll find his uh, mug covering every single bowl there was, is still going. Um, so, uh, yes. So, uh, head on over, sportsbookreview.com. Um, and if you do watch them, uh, can you watch it right to the end? Because that's when I decide which book I'm going to be using. When I shouldn't have done, I should have said right at the very beginning. So excuse me, got but please stay with on, me. Got it on camera. <laughs> Hang in there, he'll get it right at one point. That's all right. Um, uh, yes, so Arsenal 2.72, Manchester United 2.6, and the draw 3.52. Um, I'm not going to repeat word for word what Dono said, uh, but if you scroll up, you will see. But he says that he thinks he will take his chances with Arsenal. <laughs> He's going to take his chances with Arsenal. I don't know. I don't know what makes him say that. He's going to take his chances with uh, Arsenal. Uh, but let us speak to the uh, the suffering Gunners fan over here. Uh, are you oh. going to jump in the way uh, Dono Seven's jumping in? No, no way. I wish I could. I wish I could be that confident. I mean, we almost got that morale-boosting victory against Chelsea. Then Bern Leno comes out with an absolute howler. They pour, pour up the pitch, try to get a winner, totally uh, immature, and get done on the break and lose 2-1. Horrendous stuff. Uh, Man United's a team that worry me against Arsenal because... They like to play on the break. They play good counter-attacking football. They're very quick going forwards and they're in good form at the moment. Uh, Arsenal haven't got a good record against Man United at all. Uh, this is a game that I think Man United will score in uh, probably at least once, maybe twice. I'm a bit wary of Arsenal just because of the, the new manager bounce with Arteta. I think they're slowly starting to improve, but the defensive issues are still going to be there. Um, and yeah, they're... they're they're a work in progress. Um, if, if if I was playing the outrights, I'd be leaning towards Man United just because they're better against the teams that like to play football and like to dominate possession so they can hit you on the break with their pace. But I'm just going to stick with the Alex Classic bet of uh, both teams to score and over 2.5 goals at 1.87. I still think Arsenal will get on the score sheet yeah. even if they do lose. Yeah. I like that bet, to be honest with you. Um, not playing the outright, although definitely leaning towards Manchester United. Um, uh, Shamil says Manchester United win and both teams to score. King Jorge, Arsenal problem is defence. Um, oh, there was another one as well. Rude boy, Man United and both teams to score. Yes. Ulrich, Man United all the way. So a lot of fans on uh, the Arsenal, uh, just Don07 is jumping in on the Arsenal win. What are you doing? Uh, Arsenal looked really good on the uh, front foot the other day. I was really encouraged by the way that they were uh, they were actually being more disciplined early on in the game and they sat and they fed and they passed it quickly and there was good movement as well. I, I think the absolute banker of the weekend is the Alex Classic at 1.87. Um, the f good thing is, with the Alex Classic, is Man United are so good on the break. Manchester United will be over the moon to have the likes of James, Martial, uh, Rashford, and whoever else he sits in there to hit them on the break, almost cheating. But I think we'll see a different Arsenal this weekend, and I'm going for Arsenal to win the game and both teams to score at 3.75. I think this crowd, and if I remember rightly, over about the last 25 years, Arsenal hate Manchester United, and they will keep going. The crowd will stay in the game. Um, and I can easily see this being a mad game of 2-1, 3-2, but I'm gonna, I think Arsenal, the home side, at 3.75 and both teams to score is probably the way for me to go. You're always swimming against the current you, aren't you? Well, I'm, you say that, but I've got <laughs> Arsenal at home who will score goals. Man United don't keep many clean sheets. They were lucky. True. Yeah, we'll go for the Alice Classic. Over That's to my banker. 
Okay. The Alex Classic, my bank. Oh, so right, because you doing, said you got two bets. Yeah, time. so basically Ooh. what I'm doing is I think the Alex Classic is an absolute moral. Yes. So if I put my two units on there, I'm going to win 1.74 units. So if I put one unit on Arsenal and both teams to score and it doesn't come off, I've still made 0.74 units on the game. Don 07, yes, I'm not alone. Yeah, you, yeah, and, you and Don 07 <laughs> yeah. swimming up yeah. the Well, I'll, I'll drown. Going up the <laughs> <laughs> well, just, well, at least well, I've got Don to push roll. down and keep me floating. You are on a roll. You guys don't like Manchester United? No? <laughs> I'd be leaning towards them, but you never know with Arsenal. I mean, they've got to get a result sooner or later. Yeah, Something's got to happen to kickstart Arteta's managerial career. They almost got it against Chelsea. They were so close. If it wasn't for Bern Leno making that individual error, they'd have won the game. Uh, could be Man United, could be their scalp, but... Yeah, I, I'd be leaning towards Man United, but not confident enough to play well, it. This is a Man United side that just went to Watford and got beat. I know there was mm. a howler and a penalty. But listen, I think the home side, with the feel-good factor, obviously the new manager with a big side coming to town. I think Arsenal, uh, for, uh, both teams, I think the both teams are score is a knocker. Okay, yeah. so, and I think the over is a knocker because both teams are going to go for the win. Both teams have gotten plenty pace in the final third of their opponents. So, I mean, listen... You could actually go with Arsenal and both teams score three seventy five, or you could go with Man United to win and both teams to score at maybe three sixty, and you're going to make money either way. I think there's goals in this game. Pay your money, take your choice. But I'm going to go. With, I'm going to go with the home side, and it's a moral, Alex. Classic. Moral. That's moral. what a moral flashlights that word. Paddy's Alex Classic, a banker here. Rude boy finishes the conversation by saying, "I hate both." There you go.